My name is Brad Gaber with Pure Thoughts Horse Rescue. Uh, we are a horse rescue that's been around 15 years and we rescue horses going to slaughter for human consumption. Uh, these two polo ponies we rescued from different polo clubs and different polo people around town and that's the sport I like to compete in. So I like to train horses for that sport. Uh, Espuma over here came from Argentina and we've been playing her for a couple of years. She bowed her tendon last summer. So we haven't been playing her and mostly what my veterinarian wanted me to do is just rest the horse. Um, so that's what we did. And then I got introduced to this laser wrap. So we started using the laser wrap on her leg three days in a row and then a day off. Usually we do that twice a week. Um, and she, the inflammation's gone down drastically. The tendon's getting much stronger. And now she can turn out with all the horses right like a normal horse and running around and having fun without soreness. So we're hoping to be able to play her again this summer. Um, Chiquita over here, she's a polo pony who is playing now. She's another Argentine Carrillo. They're both about 15 or 16 years old. Um, Chiquita had a split bone that popped over here. It's a supporting bone from the cannon bone. And so we see this calcification, which isn't really bothering her, but sometimes when she plays a lot, she gets a little bit of inflammation. So I started using the laser wrap on her because of that inflammation. But Chiquita also had a second issue that I didn't realize the laser wrap was going to help, which is she gets cranky um, sometimes when she's playing, especially when she's playing against horses that are faster than her. She gets angry about it. Um, so she'll try to bite them in the face. So what, the, and on the way to Polo, in the horse trailer, she'll be biting on the side of the trailer, just all anticipating to play. What we've noticed with this laser wrap is that she isn't doing that really anymore. She, in the beginning, she was kicking at the trailer and biting at the partition on the way to Polo. And then she was very quiet at Polo and then we'd get on and play and she'd try to bite at the horse's faces. Now she's not kicking at the wall at all. She's biting at the wall just a little tiny bit, not very much. And she's not biting at horse's faces anymore when she's playing. She's much more focused of a playing horse um, because of her getting angry, it made her more challenging to play because she wasn't focused on the game as much as she needed to be. Now that she's staying so calm um, and really enjoying the game again, she's playing better, everybody's complimenting her. She's always in the right spot. She's not as concerned about the horses that are next to her, so she's not being aggressive towards them. Um, and you can see she's just a nice calm horse. Today we exercised her, which is we call in follow pulling a set. And Sutton, she used to bite at the horse that was leading her. And today, and many, you know, the past couple of months, she's been very quiet about it. She's saying yes. That's a very nice job. So <laughs> this laser wrap as a secondary response has definitely calmed the mind. We didn't expect it to calm the mind. Um, at first I thought if we're lowering inflammation and pain, well that makes sense of why she's feeling better. But it's not going to change her emotional response. Years ago, and I know I didn't mention this earlier, when I was playing her on the field, she used to, the reason she came out of polo about three years ago was she would get really angry and then take off on the field with whoever was playing her at that time. And so we stopped playing her on the field because of that. And I had recommended, I was recommended to give her an antipsychotic drug. So we gave her the antipsychotic drug once, it lasted for two weeks. Um, and it definitely worked, but I felt that I'm not going to do that to a horse. I'm not going to give them antipsychotics just so they could play a game for me. So I, I had given her to a little boy and he's learned to play polo with her. He just hasn't been playing. So uh, I put her back to work in the arena this year. And with the aid of this laser wrap, she's a much happier, very in shape horse and she always gets complimented. So tomorrow she'll be playing on the field. The school will be playing this summer. Um, and we'll continue using the product on all the different horses here.